Hi, do we really know Africa or do we just think we do? Let's ponder upon this for a moment. It's time to pull back the curtain on the deeply ingrained stereotypes about Africa. The origins of these perceptions are often lost in the annals of history, yet they continue to shape our understanding of this vast, diverse continent and its vibrant people. They influence our views, our discussions and our attitudes. As we dive into this journey, prepare to challenge what you think you know about Africa. The roots of African stereotypes can be traced back to the earliest contacts between Africa and the Western world. Picture this, we're in the age of exploration. The West, driven by curiosity and the promise of wealth, set sail for uncharted territories, bringing them face to face with the diverse African continent. This was a time of first impressions. To the Western eye, unfamiliar with the richness of African cultures, the continent appeared primitive and underdeveloped. This perception was not due to a lack of civilization on the African side, but rather a misunderstanding born out of cultural differences. The West, with its own standards of progress and development, failed to appreciate the unique ways in which African societies were organized and advanced. But the story doesn't end there. The burgeoning transatlantic slave trade further cemented these misconceptions, as millions of Africans were forcibly uprooted from their homes and dehumanized the West began to view Africa not as a continent of diverse cultures, but as a source of forced labor. Then came the era of colonialism. Western powers, in their bid to extract resources and expand their empires, perpetuated the notion of Africa as a dark continent in need of civilizing. This narrative served to justify their domination and exploitation, reinforcing the stereotypes that had already taken root. These early contacts set the stage for the stereotypes that would persist for centuries to come. As we entered the 20th century, the world saw Africa through a lens tinted with stereotypes. The 20th century was a time of great change and development globally. However, the portrayal of Africa in popular culture during this period did little to reflect the continent's true diversity and progress. Hollywood, with its far-reaching influence, played a significant role in reinforcing existing stereotypes. Films and TV shows often showcased Africa as a monolithic entity, a land of wilderness and primitiveness, ignoring its rich cultural diversity, its bustling cities, and its myriad of vibrant civilizations. Similarly, the media too played its part in perpetuating these stereotypes. News reports from Africa were, and in many cases, still are predominantly about wars, famine, and poverty. The stories of innovation, growth and progress often go untold, further entrenching the stereotypical narratives. This representation of Africa, incomplete and skewed, continued to shape global perceptions of the continent. Africa's progress in various fields, be it in technology, arts or governance, was overshadowed by these persisting clichés. The continent's diversity, with its over 2,000 languages and countless ethnic groups, was largely ignored. As Africa underwent vast changes during the 20th century, it was unfortunate that the world's perception of the continent remained largely unchanged. A rich and diverse continent was seen through a narrow lens, a tale of two Africas, one real and the other a creation of stereotypes. Despite the vast changes taking place in Africa during this period, the world's perception of the continent remained largely unchanged. Fast forward to the present day, and many of these stereotypes still persist. They continue to shape perceptions of Africa, often casting a shadow over the continent's vibrant diversity, its rich cultures, and its boundless potential. These stereotypes, like stubborn stains, refuse to fade away. They linger, shaping how the world views Africa, and in turn influencing how Africa navigates the world. However, it's not all doom and gloom. The tides are turning with concerted efforts being made to challenge and change these stereotypes. From the bustling streets of Lagos to the serene landscapes of Nairobi, Africans themselves are at the forefront of this change. They are using the power of their voices, the strokes of their brushes, and the clicks of their keyboards to paint a more accurate picture of their beloved continent. But it's not just about dispelling stereotypes, it's about acknowledging and understanding them. By doing so, we can begin to see their origins, their persistence and their impact. And most importantly, we can start to move beyond them, forging a path towards a more nuanced understanding of Africa. 
The road ahead may be long and winding, but there is hope. There is a vibrancy, a resilience, a determination that defines Africa and its people. And it's this that will ultimately reshape the narrative. As we look to the future, it's time to rewrite the narrative and see Africa for what it truly is. A continent rich in diversity, culture and potential. In the end, the question remains, how do we break free from these stereotypes? We've laid bare the origins of African stereotypes, the tale of two Africas and the present and future scenarios. It's vital to challenge these stereotypes, promoting a more accurate understanding of this diverse continent. Africa is not a monolith, but a vibrant mosaic of cultures, languages and histories. The journey towards a more nuanced understanding of Africa begins with challenging our own perceptions. So the next time you think about Africa, remember it's more than just a stereotype. Be sure to hit that like or subscribe button and keep being curious, beautiful and continue learning. Check out some of my other videos and keep staying curious.